It's 11 o'clock. I woke up at 10.30 and I have a lot to do because yesterday I slept in super late and putzed around and went to a plant store. I'm making pancakes in the dark. Cause see, look, if I don't turn on the big light, the light doesn't get all the way in. So I just turned on the stove light. I don't need to see everything right now. Then I'm gonna get ready to actually do stuff. So I just filmed with Wache Cosmetics and the mascara and the highlighter. Honestly, this stuff is so nice. So I'm really impressed. I only used a couple of these to correct my, I have like some pimples. You can still see them up close, but I find that, you know, with a little bit of camouflage, you can get away with not full coverage all over the face, which is so much more comfortable day to day. When you work nine to five, you know, because you just know. Anyway, I'm gonna go outside. I need to go and pick up some towels because I wanna clean up my bathroom. So I'm getting these towels from Simon's. Hopefully they came in because I did an in-store order. I told you guys like, I like to use Rakuten and they were having 12% cash back on Simon's. Then on top of it, I have cash back on my credit card. And when I order, to pick up in store you get two times the simon's points and simon's points translate to money not sponsored i'm just always looking for ways to cut corners for myself and that is kind of how like oh i've had on the top of my head that i wanted to replace my bathroom towels for a while just because the stuff i have is really old and there's nothing wrong with it but there's something to say about getting out of a shower and using like fresh terry cloth fluffy towels and yeah i've really wanted to invest in that uh i'm i might pass by canadian tire i might go to the greenhouse because i just i'm curious to know if they have any hoyas new hoyas uh, hoyas are my addiction right now and maybe winter is home sense because i love going there too and then i gotta do some real decluttering i know it seems kind of like hypocritical to be shopping while decluttering but i'm not shopping for the same kinds of things that i'm decluttering if that makes any sense yeah that's <laughs> how so i'm justifying it there's got to be like a no by november where i only purchase gifts i think that that's what's going to happen in november so for now says if you can hear the washing machine that's because i'm washing sheets i went to pick up the towels i got one planty thing which is this guy right here i gotta reset the apartment and basically do all of my sunday chores i did homemade butter chicken for the entire weekend so i could basically like not cook all weekend i was originally thinking of doing takeout and staying home and being hyper productive but the weather was so nice i knew it would be raining today yeah anyway so let's uh let's do some chores together are you seeing how dark it is i even had to put on the evening light oh another thing i have to do which i like kind of don't want to do today because it's raining is take out my window ac there was a year where i did not take the ac off until it snowed i'm not proud of it i'm not <laughs> Part of me is like, do I wash the towels first or do I wash my dirty sheets first? I think I'll wash the sheets first because these are going to need a little bit more time in the dryer. Whatever, right? Yeah, the only reason I didn't make my bed this morning was because I wanted to wash my sheets. Yep. <laughs> Yay, so fun.
I made sort of a vegetable soup by roasting some vegetables including purple cabbage and I just have this on hand. It's in the freezer actually and I portioned it out so that I can freeze it bit by bit and just have it as a snack for lunch. And I've got some potatoes going in here because they were a little bit on the edge but it's just about enough for a serving so I'm gonna have that with some mayo and ketchup because I have the craving and we'll be making the rice. I like to take my washed rice, fry it a bit, get it toasty, and then I add my water. And then you know the drill, it's time to put the dishes away, and then wash the dishes that are in the sink. Ugh. Okay, so I more or less tidied up. I, wa I gotta wash the counter though and um, I got the rice to the point that I wanted to and um, now I have it covered on a simmer. I have a timer on. I'd been keeping this bowl of apples in the fridge for a while because I wanted to make a compote. Uh, compote? Is that how you say it? Well, like basically an apple crumble type of thing. That would be a good homemade dessert for me to take through the week and that saves me from throwing out these apples even though they were super on sale. I just don't feel good throwing them all out, so uh, I think I'm gonna cut them up and do that. Some potatoes because I'm also a little bit short 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 on chicken the rest of the potatoes are just here i'm crushing some walnuts to add into our crumble mix it's five o'clock when i started this video i didn't think i was gonna end up doing a lot of cooking things but to clean out my fridge sometimes i just cook this stuff to make sure it's ready for me to eat and so that i can get all of the waste out because my trash day is wednesday morning and if i wait until tuesday night to do it i i won't I know myself. By the way, this is a bootleg apple crumble. Basically, I cut out the topping because it's, I mean, it's like a lot of sugar. This is just kind of the fruity bit of it and some nuts, a little bit of butter, some lemon juice, a little sugar, a little cinnamon, and flour stirred up. And then I put it in the toaster oven for a while and I can reheat it as I go or I can have it with a little bit of ice cream or yogurt if I wish. And I'm vacuuming. I gotta get the attachment. Oh my gosh, I'm like oily already. <laughs> I'm on my second batch of apple crumble by the way and uh, it smells like fall in here of apples and cinnamon and yummy goodness. So I'm still heating up some of my crumble and some food. I don't have the energy to... Maybe I'll do the drawer dresser declutter tonight. I don't know actually. While I'm putting away my clothes, I still have all my laundry hanging in the spare room and it's definitely dry because I washed it yesterday before leaving the house. All of this has to go on hangers, pajamas, underwear, yes I fold my underwear <laughs> as you saw, uh, some tops for my top store, I gotta hang this, and these kind of just like don't belong here, they're not seasonal items except for the plaid shirt which I'm debating on decluttering. Oh my gosh, this feels so good, I love it when my room is like this. Even the chair has nothing on it. Oh! I'm all about those simple pleasures. I think I'm just gonna have some supper and get back on the love is blind. I, I don't really pay attention while I watch it. Sometimes I'm like dilly-dallying on my phone, but I just really feel like fetching out, honestly. And, oh, I forgot to mention this. This is a total game changer for me, especially on days when I have to go to the office because in my mind, I'm like, oh, I really don't wanna go. I always keep what I'm planning to wear or a couple of outfit options at the beginning of my wardrobe so that in the morning I get up half asleep and get dressed really quick and run out the door. Is that the most ideal thing to do? Absolutely friggin -lutely not. In the ideal world, I would be getting up at five o'clock and like editing videos and blah, blah, blah. I like to be up late. I'm a night owl. I need to stop identifying that way. 
but I just revenge bedtime takes over me and I start like tidying up after the plants and like doing random mishmash stuff yeah I know I recognize it's a toxic habit but what can I do change I could change but you know sometimes sometimes you don't want to <laughs> You know, I can't have butter chicken without some nan. I have a glass of water while I'm waiting for that to heat up just to kind of curb my appetite a little bit because sometimes when there's dessert, there's only one sweater that didn't dry yet. Anyway, just checking up on my planty friends. I judged these guys up yesterday. Two Hoyas, I think it's a pubicalyx splash. Oh my god, you guys, this is a lot of food. But I didn't have lunch, and this is my leftovers. So, ooh, I'm so excited. Future Alexa here. I just came on to tell you guys that my next video is going to be a closet declutter. I hope you enjoyed the Love is Blind reunion if you watched that. My god, haven't we all been a Marissa before? I've definitely been a Hannah too. I've been the mean girl and the sweet, heartbroken girl. I got sidetracked, I'm sorry. Full declutter my dresser and my closet and then my mother's dresser as well so that's kind of why this has taken so long i really fell behind and i just procrastinated on doing it but knowing full well that i had to do it before the end of the year so if you're looking for some motivation to declutter things before the end of the year you know you got to subscribe and keep watching that next video is coming really soon and um yeah i hope you guys have a wonderful week bye